So as we have discussed, we can take your age, your bone density, and other risk factors to estimate your risk of having a bone break in the next 10 years. Okay. And the best way to show you this is to imagine 100 people like you, each one represented by a bone. And if we were to follow these 100 people like you for 10 years, what we will find is in those 10 years, 32 people will develop a bone break. The other 68 will not. There is, of course, no way to know if you will be one of the ones that is destined to have a bone break or the other group. Okay. Because we can't tell, we'll have to treat all 100 people like you. Mm -hmm. So what happens if we treat all 100 people like you? That is shown in this second page. Okay. And you'll see it is that if we treat all 100 people, what will happen is 18 people here will still have a bone break despite taking medication regularly. Okay. You can also see in yellow here 14 people that were originally destined to have a bone break mm -hmm. but have avoided by taking it, the medication. Okay. Um, overall, 82 people will not get a bone break mm -hmm. if we were to give treatment to these 100 people. Okay. Again, I have no way of knowing if you'll be one of the people that uh, will, are, is not destined to have a bone break and will take medication for no mm -hmm. reason or the people that will have a bone break despite taking medication okay. or you'll be among those who, being destined to have a bone break, avoid it by taking the medication. Okay. Okay. What do you think about these benefits? I think the benefits are good, but I don't know anything about the medications. Or is that a hard medication to take? or? Yeah, very good question. I have listed those things here in the back. In terms of the downsides, as we've discussed, you take it once a week on an empty stomach and you stay upright okay. uh, uh, for about 30 minutes after you take it. This is to avoid any, cons any problems when you're swallowing the tablet. Okay. Some people get belly pain, but uh, those, those troubles stop uh, if we take the medication away. Okay. So if there were to happen, you can let me know. Mm -hmm. A more serious problem is uh, 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 painful sores in the bone, okay. in the bone, the jaw bone, uh, that may need some surgery. They happen to about one or so every 10,000 patients. So it's a rare complication. Okay. It's more common in people that have tooth extractions all the time. Is okay. that something that... Not a problem. Mm -hmm. And uh, because it's a generic medication, uh, the expense is not significant. Okay. So what are you thinking about, uh, about uh, doing? I'd like to give it a try. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, give it a try. Put this up in the fridge at home. Okay. If at some point this doesn't turn out the way you and I expect it will turn out, uh, give me a call and we can discuss this further. Okay. Sounds good.